I quickly wanted to talk about <clears throat> I like how on video that looks like ah but I'm approved anyway ow <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I wanted to actually talk about like what I believe as far as government and what it should be like because I ra rarely do that and I usually just on Facebook. I haven't touched my gun in a couple of days. I want I want to mess with it. Um, on Facebook, usually I just share stuff from the right. And it is, especially right now, it is kind of what I agree with. But it's possible it won't always be that way. Because I tend to... I guess a way to put it is... Hmm, that's the Starbucks pumpkin spice cream thing. I don't think it's that good. Someone I know was like, you should try it. And I, I was like, well, I think I tried it last year. I don't remember though. And now I remember why I don't remember because it's not that good and it's very forgettable. But focus. <laughs> um, so, okay. On Facebook, I share a bunch of stuff that's right winger and crazy out there right winger stuff oh like i got a facebook banned for bullying biden and then no i got one post that i got in trouble for because it bullied biden bullied you know you're running for president but you can't take the heat then go away um but i bullied biden so that one post got in trouble and then the second one that got me in trouble was it was a, a picture of Kyle Rittenhouse and it he was sitting at a table and it said AR-15s are better than skateboards change my mind and I thought it was funny but Facebook thought it was not so I could not do anything for 24 hours because they said He's a bad guy, but he's not, if you watch the videos. And he will probably, once it actually goes to court, he will probably, I'm not a lawyer, but he probably will get like almost nothing, get charged with almost nothing and no jail time and all that stuff. Um, for going off and no sleep, I am quite hyper. Anyway, so... So that got me a 24 hour ban and that just makes me want to post more right winger stuff because I guess kind of the way I see things is our country should be very middle. It shouldn't be over here. It shouldn't be over here. It should be just straight down the middle because when it comes down to it, you have your group of people over here, you have your group of people over here, and compromise is right here. So when, when like one group is getting told you cannot bully Biden or you cannot say this guy that is not a villain is a villain. Wait, I said that backwards. You cannot say that this guy that is not a villain is a villain. I keep on messing that up. You cannot say that this guy that is not a villain is not a villain. Whatever. Let's let's continue. Um but you can't say that he's a good guy. That's not allowed. And that is messed up. I mean I know Facebook is a private company and they can do whatever they want. But I guess it comes down to the stuff I believe. 
which is <clears throat> let people do whatever they want. Basically, as long as you're not killing anybody, as long as you're not all whacked out on drugs, and as long as you're not, basically as long as you're not harming anyone around you, do whatever. That's, to put it really simply, that's what I think politically. Um, so, like, basically, the government should be tiny. It should... Part of me wonders if we even need a military. Because, I mean, imagine if... Imagine if everyone was comfortable with these. Imagine if everyone had their... Had their sidearm, had their... Whatever they wanted. Had a rocket launcher, if they wanted. I'm... I would be okay with that. Um, but everybody has this. Everybody's comfortable with this. And everybody just takes care of themselves. I don't think that would be bad. Dog and cats living together. Mass hysteria. Um... But, like, right now I've been kind of on everybody I know and be like, hey, these are nice. Get comfortable with them, just in case stuff gets worse. Then you're good. Well, not good, but then you're more protected. And, I mean, maybe a small, I don't know. See, part of me thinks the military... Even that, it doesn't really need to exist. I mean, it does, but it doesn't need to be there. Ideally, I would say that we should have some sort of unemployment because stuff happens and I'm okay with helping other people out. Like, I know it's a tax stuff and I'm okay with that because as long as it's something that cannot be abused, I'm okay with helping people out when they're in a rough time. Basically taking tax money and putting it into making sure every single American is covered in case of emergencies. Sure. That's fine. And um, <laughs> but I mean, even like something like building roads, does it have to be a government thing? Oops. Does that really require a government putting their nose in there and doing anything with it? But then, I wonder who owns the land of roads. That would be the one thing that, I mean, maybe there could be a reason for people to own the property that is roads. And then, I don't know. But basically, small, small government is good, in my opinion. So that's why I see all this shutdown stuff. And uh, Evers just extended the mask mandate, which people are like, Oh my god, I can't believe he did it! And I've been saying he's going to do it for like weeks. I'm like, oh, okay. This is going to be years of, hey, you have to wear a mask. Unless you don't, but I didn't say that. I mean, if you don't, 
really bother to wear a mask at all is that does the mask mandate affect you? Um, but usually I just talk about what's going on and I don't know, I just want to make something saying what I believe because what I like doing is, my God, you too. I'm thinking our dog is picking on our cat because our cat is hiding between my legs right now. He definitely picks, our cat definitely picks on the dog too sometimes though. Um, but yeah, small government, it's good. <clears throat> no lockdowns, no, just don't bother people. Leave them alone. Let them buy rocket launchers if they want. I would say the only thing that might go against that, people might be confused, is that abortions, I don't like. They just, mm, they don't sit well with me. Um, basically, I would say from very, almost from conception, I would say it's basically murder. It's, you're killing a human. Therefore, it's murder. Because if you kill a human outside the womb, it's murder. I think some people are trying to change that, that you can kill actual little babies outside the... after they're born, but <laughs> that's still murder. It's taking a human's life is murder. So once it's a human, if you take its life, it's murder. I don't know. It's not that complicated. Okay, bye.